All right, what's going on, people? It's your boy, Theo, and this is A Real Talk. So, the breaking news today is that Jesse Nelson is leaving Little Mix. Now, the news doesn't even come as a shock, to be honest, because she previously announced that she was going to take a break from the band, um, and it was going to be on an indefinite basis. Indefinite basis. Um, but the news broke out today that she's going to leave the band for good. Now, I did a video talking about um, her documentary that she put that put out, and it's in relation to that. Um, here's what I think. I think that the way that she's done this, um, it has to be respected because mental health is a serious thing. I made um, I made videos talking about it, and. It is a serious thing. One can only take so much. And if we are so focused on what we're doing in our lives, like paying uh, paying um, the bills and, and worrying about stuff, you don't take the time out to try and do things that make you happy. Now, in Jesse Nelson's case, being in a band, it is just very, very hard. It's hard because you are... Um, away from your family most of the time then you got to do photo shoots then you got to do music videos then you got to do interviews then you got to make music it's it takes so much out of you and not to mention she's got to deal with the trolls now in the documentary she talked about that um and having to and having to try to deal um with juggling juggling being a band and her life it's not easy it's not easy. And there are many bands that actually came before Little Mix that actually had to struggle. Um, and it's just not been easy for them to, to kind of get themselves uh, get themselves to doing what, they, what they're what they doing. It's all, it's all well and good to see that they're, they're together and they want to make music and everything else. But there's so much that goes on behind the scenes that, you know, we're not privy to know. So I do think that she has done the right thing. I wish her nothing but the best. Um, I don't know what she's going to do. She even sells, She even said herself that she doesn't know what she's going to do um, going forward. But she's going to try and focus on trying to be happy and trying to, you know, enjoy life. I mean, look at the year that we had. And, the, you know, the ups and downs of what's been going on. Yeah? We have been put into a tier system. We've had two lockdowns. We've had um, we had over sixty um, thousand deaths in this country, you know. Pe people's livelihoods have been taken away, jobs have been lost, you know, um, and it's just been tough for everybody because we've all had our lives taken away from this, and it does affect our mental health in in general. So I can understand where Jesse Nelson's coming from. I mean, I only had. A brief experience in in a recording studio. I only spent a couple of days in a recording studio, and I recorded the tune, and and um, I understood what that's like. And I and I have this kind of mindset when it comes to music about um, what's um, why did they do this? Why did they do that? How it's written? All that stuff. I have to I have to think about all of that stuff when I'm listening to music. Now I can't just like a song, but that's just me. Um. So I experienced experienced only a tenth of that. She's done things on a much more broader scale. I mean, seriously. But yeah, um, little mix will continue as far as as far as I'm aware. Um, but obviously, it's not going to be the same without Jesse in there. But obviously, this this is tough. It's tough for every little mix fan out there. Um, the mixers. It's it's hard. Um, and uh, yeah, I only can support Jesse Nelson. I can I completely understand where she's coming from. I mean, speaking as an NHS worker, I mean, look up look up what me and my colleagues up and down the country have to go through every day over the past year. It's not been easy at all. But we've we've done our utmost to do the best job that we can actually do. So I completely understand where she's coming from. 
If you like this video, please like it, subscribe if you're new around here. Don't forget to hit the comments um, section and let me know what you think about Jessie's situation. Let me know what you think about um, her, her leaving the band. And let me know what you think about your mental health. Let's talk about this. Let's talk about mental health. Let's talk about what's, what makes us, what makes us happy. What, what makes us kind of, you know, gets us to a point where we just want to take a step back and do us, you know, what limits can we actually go to, you know, let's try and talk about this together. Let's try and help one another. Cause I think that's more important. If we help people, if we help people, if we start talking to each other, maybe, just maybe, the world will be a better place. But instead, it's all dog-eat-dog, dog, you know. It's all about cancelling people and, and, and everything else, right? Let's try and actually support one another and be kind to one another. Because we only got one life. And I'm in a position now where I just want to live my life as best as I can possibly can. Without no stress, without no worries. You know, I know that the fact of life for the matter is like paying bills and mortgages and everything else. But if you don't have fun in your life, if you don't have happiness in your life, then you're not living life. That's where I'm coming from. And I think Jessie will go and do just that. Live her life. Be happy. So, yeah, that's all i got to say on this video, people. Um, look out for my end of 2020 video coming out very, very soon. It will be a shakedown episode, episode 53. So don't forget to check that out. Thanks for watching. My name's Theo. I'm out. Peace.